super excited for you to be on my vlog today welcome back for some of you who have watched my um, previous vlog I really do appreciate that today as you guys probably can guess I'm wearing a black clothes meaning that I'm about to head to work very very soon I still wanted to capture a video before I leave because whenever I come home it's gonna be super late and that we won't have the daylight, um, the better light for the video. So I have a very long day ahead of me at work today. And on top of it, it is a very, very exciting day for me because I finally received something that I have mentioned in my previous video, which is super, super special for me. So I started my day very, very early today. My husband woke up at five o'clock in the morning because he had to leave to a butcher shift today. So whenever he leaves, I have to wake up as well because I cannot sleep on my own. I literally do have a trouble sleeping alone, to be honest. I had to wake up at 5.30 a.m., but I did have a really, really good workout this morning. I practiced a core workout. I felt really, really good after my workout. It was about an hour of workout this day. And after that, I did have a really, really good breakfast. I actually captured the some footage of my breakfast. I'm gonna go ahead and insert it right now. Coffee is ready. The rice is also done. This is going to be my lunch today. I'm gonna eat some poke. And I am making myself some breakfast right now. I already cut up half apple and the half banana as well. I am going to use this yogurt today. This is something that I have never tried before. It is from Maple Hill. It is the organic brand. And they do make a really good yogurt, I heard. I do use some cinnamon to my breakfast. And I'm gonna use some coconut flakes and also some chia seeds as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour about half of it. This much is enough. Some chia seeds. Now we're gonna mix all of it together. And then we're gonna pair it with some coconut flakes. Very healthy and beautiful breakfast for today. And by the way, if you guys are interested about how I usually make my uh, lunch for work, please leave it in the comment below. <laughs> please leave it in the comment below. I will make a note to make a video about it as well, just in case if you're interested. But now, but now let's go ahead and show you guys the special baby that is in front of me yes guys i finally received my telescope yay <laughs> look at this beautiful piece of art guys oh my goodness i am so so happy today and super excited i finally received my very very first telescope this is from a brand that's called the g skyer and uh, it is the year d80 millimeter series which is really really nice uh, lens for a telescope because you will be able to see all the planets and also some stars as well so i thought this would be the best uh, place to start for my astronomy journey <laughs> And this is what I got, you know, at the end. This uh, telescope came in this huge box right there. And it was a huge mess when I actually tried to assemble this product. Oh my goodness, guys, the tripod that it comes with is extremely sturdy. I think this on its own costs over $100. And the telescope itself is made from pure iron. It's very, very sturdy. You know, you can tell it's a very heavy duty product. And it does come with the several lenses as well, which I'm gonna show you guys in a minute. And then this bar right here is extremely heavy. So I think this is the one that actually controls the balance of the telescope. And I am still super impressed with the, um, 
with a tripod that it comes with it. And by the way, these are the lenses that I got uh, additionally to the telescope. They do send you um, four different types of lenses. And the one that I'm using right now is a 10 millimeter. This one right here is the base lens that it comes with it. And it is the Barlow lens, which gives a three times magnification to the image. And this one right here is the... Um, where is this it is the five millimeter lens and the, another one is this one right here which is the biggest lens it is the g skyer 25 millimeter uh, lens so you can get a very very clear uh, picture with this lens right here and additionally uh, it does come with the phone holder as well in case if you want to take a picture with your phone and this is the Bluetooth uh, remote control. You will be able to take pictures with your iOS digital camera and then um, and the small ones as well. So I have not gotten a chance to use this one yet, but I believe that it works with the, um, the watch battery. And on the side, uh, you do get this um, the cleaning cloth as well which is really nice it's been super super cloudy because of the rain but the day is looking super nice maybe tonight we're gonna have uh, some really really good uh footage with the moon oh my goodness i'm gonna see if i can um capture the moon with my phone and also i cannot get over the mountain today it is gorgeous guys day I woke up again super super early today I could not get a chance to do some workout because I had to do a work on my computer I had to write some stuff and work on my papers this morning but um, I'm glad I woke up super early because uh, I got a lot of things done and uh, yes as you probably have guessed I'm again about to head to work I have about seven hour shift today um, but I don't want the work shifts to get me distracted from vlogging. I will try to vlog as much as possible, as much as I can. Just to let you know, guys, yesterday was a very, very exciting day for me because my telescope has arrived and uh, I actually took my telescope to my balcony because it was super, super dark. Especially here on my way, we don't have too much light pollution, which is amazing. This is part of the reason that I decided to purchase a telescope because we have the best opportunity to uh, you know like a stargazing or to learn about the planets because we get the best view because of not having too much light pollution again so anyway I took my telescope to the balcony and I was trying to uh, find a uh, Mars because I was literally seeing it with my own eyes but the, the telescope, oh my goodness, it's a skill to learn, you know. I am such an amateur and so naive to think that I could literally just put it on, assemble it, and then boom, it's ready to go. No, it's not. <laughs> oh my goodness, there are so many bits and pieces that I have to learn to uh, put it together and align on the telescope. By the way, the telescope that I got is an equatorial instrument, meaning that it adjusts itself whenever I am um, looking at the planets because as you guys know the earth spins and the, as the earth spins are the planets in the sky look like they are moving so it's kind of hard to adjust a telescope but with my telescope it's very easy because it actually adjusts itself and on a completely different note I uh, ended up purchasing a few things from Ulta yesterday a lot of skincare products were on sale and uh, I thought I would take advantage and try something new that I have never tried before. So these are the few products that I picked up yesterday from Ulta. I did uh, get a cleanser and also an exfoliator. 
and the makeup remover on the side from uh, Yes to Cucumbers. So I have never tried any of these products before and this is by the way just the empty box of this product. This cleanser right here is such a unique product. I have never, never tried uh, anything from this brand before. It is the uh, La Roche Posay. <laughs> If I'm pronouncing the brand correctly, it is actually made in France. It's a French company. Their products are formulated or I would say designed with dermatologists. So this is the uh, brightening foaming cream cleanser. If you take a look at the ingredients, there is a lot of acids going on here. There is a glycerin, there is a myristic acid, there is a potassium hydroxide, a citric acid, the lactic acid. There is also salicylic acid as well. Oh my goodness all these acids combination of these are supposed to help you to even out your skin tone whenever you do use this product and by the way the fragrance of this product smells amazing it literally smells like a luxury product and this one is the exfoliating cream cleanser they say it's a regenerating um, cream cleanser but it does have the micro bits in the product and it is from Ole Regenerist and this one as well a new product for me I have never tried any product from Yes to Cucumbers before but this is a jumbo size as you guys can see and the, it is made of 95% natural uh, ingredients as well which is amazing so I can definitely use something like this I will give this one a try and let you guys know about it so yeah, so this was a tiny, tiny haul for you guys. Look at this baby snail. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. It doesn't have a shell. So I am on my desk right now. I actually was uh, looking at the calendar that I made about a month ago. If you guys noticed that there is actually a small calendar right here that I made myself. So this is my cosmic event calendar for 2019. I have brought all the events that's happening this year and I have also color coordinated them as well. And these pictures were kind of hard to find to be honest so I had to um, do them manually and then put it in the days where these are going to happen and just to give you an idea of my calendar this month we do have the 19th marked which is uh, let's see the super moon the moon is going to be the closest to earth so you will be able to see the moon very very up close you know it literally looks like a big giant ball in front of you <laughs> by the way if you guys didn't forget that last month we had the solar eclipse so so, which was on the 20th January with the Hawaiian time and uh, I actually did put the meteor showers as well with its own picture <laughs> and these colors signify the the phases of moon whether it's a full moon or a new moon this year I am planning to go to the Haleakala creator where the observatory is we do have one of the biggest telescopes by the way in the United States on Maui so anyway, I want to go up there and then uh, go to one of the biggest meteor showers. I think it's either in July or uh, November, one of these months. Um, there is going to be about like 150 meteors, you know, showering in like a, in an hour. That's going to be crazy. And another thing that I'm looking for, by the way, is in November, which is the Mercury transit. This is uh, where um, the Mercury is going to be moving in front of the sun. And it is going to appear as a small dot in front of the um in front of the sun so you will be able to see it with your eyes by the way i think i'm gonna end up um framing this uh calendar this needs its own frame before this year started i already knew that i was gonna get into um the astronomy and that i really wanted to learn the skill because uh, you guys know when we go to high school we do learn new skill every single year but then after high school we stop learning uh, new things so it's very important to know that uh, you have to keep your brain active you know with new stuffs you know learning skills that are kind of uh, strange or I would say that they are kind of uh, not familiar for you but it's very important that you do enjoy what you are learning and that you are curious about and by the way this is my natural hair this is uh, no blow dry at all and i thought i'm gonna embrace my natural uh, hair today as you guys can see it's very 
wavy you know if i don't straighten it it's gonna get extremely frizzy but today it seems pretty good you know the temperature is not too high so hopefully i'm gonna be fine today at work <laughs> never mind it seems like my hair is frizzing up again look at this what a struggle let's go to work Today is gorgeous guys, look at that, look at the mountains. Good morning everyone, today is Saturday, I thought I would check back in with you guys again. The weather has been super super rainy lately, it feels like this month, the fe February, oh my god I always have a trouble pronouncing these words, I think January and the February are the hardest ones to pronounce for me. <laughs> So I got myself ready already, I did my hair and I kind of smoothed the ends of my hair today just to kind of look put together. Since it has been raining, I know that my hair is gonna freeze up anyway so I didn't do that much work, but um, it's always good to look put together. And also if you notice by the way, I am wearing a bolder colored eyeshadows uh, right now. I'm using a darker colors too by the way. And whenever I do wear this kind of colors, I like to pair my lipstick with a nude color and the, a lipstick that I bought not long ago and I have been loving it is the new collection from Abeka. It is the the ultimate lipstick love collection and I'm in the shade warm blush. This is how the packaging looks like as you guys notice that and it has a magnetic top if you guys notice that it kind of locks itself that's amazing and that the formula of these lipsticks are amazing they literally feel like a butter on the lips so and other than that another thing that i wanted to um share with you guys yesterday i decided to give it a try to the derma roller uh, if you guys have ever heard about this tool before this is one of the tools like a skincare tools um, to use in order to correct the texture of your skin or uh, to correct the hyperpigmentation so it does come with the 0.25 millimeter uh, needles and uh, when you do try it on to be honest it doesn't feel like anything on the hand but when you do try it on the skin you obviously notice that something is going on <laughs> So I gave this tool a try yesterday and uh, I do have a hmm, kind of strange impression about this tool but I have to give it a try for several days in order to get a clear idea about this um, product and I thought it would be such a cool idea to make a video about it. So leave me in the comment below if you guys want to know more about this tool and uh, I will do my research for sure. Give it a try for several days and uh, let you guys know in the video. So other than this, I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog. I think I'm going to wrap up the vlog here. If you're new to my channel, by the way, make sure to subscribe if you do like skincare, if you do like beauty, if you do like lifestyle inspiration. Hopefully you're gonna come back and hang out with me in my videos. And yes, I'm going to see you in the next one, guys. You guys have a great day. Enjoy whatever that you're doing. And I'm gonna see you in the next one.